guys, welcome back. It's me, Drew, and today's video that I have for you is like, I'm um, gonna be amazing. I just feel it because uh, tonight I'm gonna be trying a bunch of popcorn. And I mean, I had like one person be like, we should do a popcorn video, and I was like, done. Like, it was like, I didn't need any convincing. So, if you're new to my channel, first of all, hi, I'm Drew, and um, you wanna join the Just Like Drew crew? Click that red subscribe button down below and join our forever family, because we're literally the best crew on because anybody and everybody can be in our crew. I've been up since like 4.45 in the morning. It's like seven something now at night. So I mean, this is gonna be like, yeah, high quality, Drew time. All right, so um, if you don't know, I recently was on a road trip uh, to Texas and uh, stopped in Tennessee. And basically it was called Taco Trippin' 2017 is basically where I went to try as many awesome tacos as I could because like, why not? Like, why not go on a trip to try tacos? Like that just seems like the right thing to do. Well, if you, know who I am, you probably know that I am obsessively in love with like popcorn, especially cheese popcorn from Sandy's Popper um, in Kenosha, Wisconsin. Like it is like the best cheese popcorn you're ever gonna have. And I don't want you to come out here and try and be like, no, 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 listen. I used to weigh over 400 pounds. I know what I'm talking about. I'm just gonna leave it at that. And that's all I'm gonna say. I know what I'm talking about when it comes to cheese popcorn and flavor and food. That's the end of it. So while in Texas, um, found a really cool popcorn spot in like, uh, I think it was like North Park Mall. I don't know for sure, like in Dallas though. And they like had like all these cool flavors of popcorn. I was like, yeah, put them in my bag. I bought, um, so eight flavors of popcorn to personally try out. And then I got like three more bags of popcorn like for the kids and my parents. So I, I, I went to Texas and I bought like 11 bags of popcorn because I mean, that's just who I am. So, and then I bought popcorn other places too. Okay, so anyways, tonight I'm gonna be trying out the popcorn in this place. Now this place is called Uptown Popcorn. Oh, and it has a website, uptownpopcorn.com. So I, the, oh, it's right there. So I, I guess I'll put a link below or something like that so you can like check them out. I didn't even know that like they were online. So this is gonna be really awesome. They're gonna be like, why is this girl trying out popcorn? I'd be like, cause I, it's popcorn and it's who I am. So I, I got eight different flavors. These are from like their savory collection. They had a whole bunch of other ones of sweet and this and that. So this first flavor I'm gonna be trying is uh, Parmesan and garlic. Um, so let's just get into it now. As an added bonus, they all have twist ties, so it's gonna take me a minute to open and close every bag of popcorn, so that's exciting. All right, so first of all, I'm just gonna give it a little smell. Not really getting too much of a scent just yet, but uh, all right, Parmesan and garlic. Ooh, dropping it, good job. Holy crap. <laughs> oh my God. This is really good. Holy crap, this is really good. Oh, I did not expect that. Oh, my expectations were so much lower than the quality of popcorn that I just tasted. Oh my God. Holy crap, this is really good. Okay, you legitimately taste like Parmesan cheese and garlic, but it's weird because the garlic's like buttery. And I also wanna point out, I bought these like a week ago and they're still like super good and like fresh. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm really excited now for the next seven bags. So <laughs> buckle up. All right, next flavor is buffalo wing. Oh my God, so if you uh, also don't know, I like spicy foods and like buffalo wings are like my jam. So I'm really excited to get up in this buffalo wing flavor and see what's happening. This is amazing. Oh my God, this is like, I'm like so happy right now. I'm trying not to cry. This is like, this is food heaven. This tastes like actual buffalo wing and it actually is like spicy. Like that buffalo wing hate, like I'm, okay, trying to, I'm trying to function. This is phenomenal. This is, this is a good day. And then next up I'm trying ranch um, because I mean, what better to follow a buffalo wing than ranch? This is crazy. Like I'm, you guys, like I had no idea that this was gonna be so delicious. Like this is kind of scaring me how good this popcorn is. Like what is going on? Okay. Earth round. Also amazing, tastes just like ranch. So I mean, I guess I really don't have to try all of these because like ideally we know they're all gonna taste great. Oh, oh, you know what though? So um, when I used to eat salads, which was basically just like 
croutons and dressing. Um, I used to love getting ranch flavored croutons because they'd be extra delicious. And this tastes like ranch flavored croutons. Oh my God. I'm dying. Okay. Next flavor I'm going to try is dill pickle. This one I'm kind of skeptical about because like with dill pickle, either you got it or you don't. So like either this is going to be banging or it's going to be like, you know, whatever. Now I've got faith in them. Because so far, the first three bags were like life, but we're going to see if they can keep it going with the dill pickle. Like so far, I'm like so impressed beyond belief with this popcorn. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's like so insanely well flavored because when you try something dill pickle, like, okay. So I used to love dill pickle chips. I don't really eat them anymore, obviously, because, like, the weight loss thing. But um, usually when you get, like, dill pickle flavored popcorn, it's got, like, that dill flavor, but it's, like, a weak dill. This is, like, punch your mama dill pickle flavored popcorn. I would never punch my mom. But you know what I'm saying? Like, it's like, wow. Like, it's, like, amazing. Oh, my God. I'm getting so excited. Ah! Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm trying to be calm, but this is so good. I wish I would have bought more. Oh my God. Okay, so next we're gonna try spicy hot cheese. Like, y'all, like I just got my second win from trying this popcorn. Like I was like feeling tired and like exhausted. My second, I'm, oh my God, spicy hot cheese. Ooh, that's hot. Ooh, that's, ooh, that's hot. Oh my God. Ooh, that's really spicy. Ooh, that's really spicy and hot. Ooh, ooh, okay. Ow. All right, so I like spicy food. This is the only one so far that I will say that I'm not really like thrilled with. Um, ooh, it's okay. So it lives up to the name, it's spicy hot cheese, but it's like, so I was talking to, this, to someone about this the other day. So when you have spicy like Tabasco or something like hot sauce, the best part about it is like when you get like that flavor of like the cayenne, like the actual like pepper, but it's not overwhelming heat. Like when something's like just like spicy, like it's just like the heat, you lose the additional flavor. So this one I'm not thrilled with. I can handle the heat. It's like not too hot, but the heaviness of the heavy handedness that they put the heat on drowns out the cheese completely. Like I really hardly got any cheese flavor and just got heat. Now, if they would have just been like spicy popcorn, fine. But I didn't really get that cheese hit to it. So, we found one that I'm not, like, feeling. Um, next up, I'm going to try is Southwest Jalapeno. Um, so, we'll see. I got a lot of spicy ones, I guess. I don't know. Um, so, I'm interested to see how they do this. Because, again, jalapeno is, like, a specific flavor. Like, it is spicy and hot. But jalapenos themselves have that, like, special taste. You know what I mean? You know, you know, you know, you know, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. No. So, uh. This one is Southwest Jalapeno. Trying to get jalapeno popcorn business. I don't like this one. Ooh. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, so again, the spice on this is kind of disjointed. Like, honestly, it was kind of garlicky and then like a little spicy, but not even that spicy. That one was not, I'm not really feeling that one. Okay, so next one I'm going to try is smoked bacon. Um, let's see what this one tastes like. So hopefully this will be a comeback. So so out of um, six so far, four have been amazing. Two have been like, you know, so hopefully... This one comes back. I honestly thought they'd all be home runs, so that's interesting. So, like, yeah. Uh, all right, this is smoked bacon. Okay. All right. Wow, this is good. I need to, like, eat more of this one to, like, fix the mistakes of the two popcorns before. Cause this is, like, wow. Mm. Yeah. Smoked bacon. And I'm actually a person... I usually don't like bacon flavored things because it's like that artificial bacon flavor. This tastes like someone took the fat off of bacon and put a little cheese with it and then like had a little popcorn, cheesy, smoky bacon babies. Oh my God, now that is something I can get down with. 
And the last layer I have to try is jalapeno ranch. And I'm uh, kind of like, I don't know how to feel about this one because the one ranch was good, but the other jalapeno was not. So what's going to happen right now? I don't know. We'll see. All right. Oh, and it's really, really seasoned. Like, look at that. Can you see that? Can you even see that? Okay. It's like offering you some. It's super duper seasoned. Look at those. Okay. Ooh, like went up my nose. Oh God, that was intense. <sighs> Woo! Well, it went up my nose. Okay, the flavor, the spice, like went up my nose. Okay, power, be strong. Okay. Wow. Um, this one definitely. Sorry, they were like literally the spice my best. Um, is really good. Um, it has a true jalapeno flavor, like jalapenos on like high school nachos and ranch. So, um, this is good. I'm happy with that one. That was intense though, because the flavor definitely wasn't prepared for it. But, so overall, six out of eight, I felt like were phenomenal. The two that I felt like were kind of whatever, the spicy hot cheese, and that was more because I wasn't eating cheese, I got spice. And then the Southwest Jalapeno, I felt like was just like not great and did not have good flavor whatsoever. But the other six were like banging and wonderful. Even that last one was good. It just like, it took me off guard because the other jalapeno was so weak. And this was like, come on girl, bring it. So that's my video of trying different flavored popcorn that like only one person asked for me to make. But I wanna make my subscriber happy, you know? Also I was gonna eat the popcorn anyway, so why not watch me eat it, you know? Cause like, who doesn't like watching people eat stuff. All right, well, that's all I have for you today. Um, if you wanna see more photos of me, because I'm usually probably dying to know, uh, check me out on Instagram, Snapchat, and on Twitter at Just Like Drew, spell the same way as down below. If you wanna be part of the Just Like Drew crew and you're not already, uh, make sure you click that red subscribe button down below and turn our forever family because we're literally the best crew because anybody and everybody can be our crew. I love you guys so stinking much, and if you like this video and you wanna see more from me, you know what to do. Just Like Drew, have an amazing day, have an amazing week, have an amazing life, and seriously, go order you some Uptown popcorn because it is banging. All right, talk to you guys so stinking soon. Love you, bye! when you put them in like you can tell right away by how they go into your skin if they're like solid or not and this like felt like it immediately like firmed up my hand like it was kind of bizarre like it didn't just like soak into it, it was like